Hi guys and welcome to my new apartment. Today I'm taking you guys with me to help me move in here. Hello friends and welcome to my new apartment. It is close to 10 p.m. and we just finished like moving all of the stuff in here. We drove down here from the bay. Of course we're starving so we got our favorite Thai food. We're gonna start furnishing and everything this week. We will eventually get to decorating. We need to because this place is bare right now. I know I look like a hoarder and a mess right now, but I swear it will be fixed. I will give you guys a really quick walkthrough right now. So bare. It also looks borderline creepy. This is our entrance way. Empty living room. We have like a mini kitchen. Alex is helping me move, of course. And then we have this little hallway. I'm gonna have three roommates or housemates. There's this bathroom room that I will be sharing with one of the girls who's gonna be in this room. There's another room that's like the same size. I told you guys it looks creepy. Can you tell it's so echoey and like what's up with I don't know if it's just California but their rooms literally don't have lights and then big room for my other two roommates but thankfully we have a washer and dryer. We also have a microwave, dishwasher and fridge already which is awesome. Today's just gonna be a lot more moving stuff around. I'm excited to get a little bit more settled in here. Guys, thank goodness Alex is here because I cannot figure this stuff out. I'll set up the internet duty, and right now I'm gonna set this up because I'm actually excited about this. I think it's really cute. So, we made a little Target stop on the way here and then forgot to get toilet paper, so we just got back and it's like almost 11 p.m. and I'm so tired, but it's just something we can't sleep without doing first. Like, if I want to shower, I gotta set this up, but at least it's cute, right? Okay, but this is so cute. I love it. It brings color here. And I also got this little bath mat from Target match with the green part of the peaches or oranges or whatever this is supposed to be. Okay, hi guys. I'm so sorry that the lighting looks awful right now, but we are doing DIY lighting with our phone flashlight because once again, I need to get like a lamp or something. Fun little update. I think somebody stole my mattress. They shipped a couple necessities here early, like some cute bed sheets, Brita, and then my freaking mattress. And it's not here, but it was delivered. So I think somebody stole it. So now we're sleeping on the floor, but luckily I do have a mattress pad. This is the vibe tonight. At least I got these floral sheets from Amazon and I think they're so cute since I'm not planning on adding a lot to my room this semester Since I'm only gonna be here for one semester. I'm trying to make it like personalized as minimally as I can Clean bedding is like the best feeling ever Hello guys, good morning. It is the next day. We have the bare minimum pretty much set up. Honestly, the mattress pad was not that bad to sleep on at all. But today I'm really hoping I can get a desk or like some kind of chair because the only place we can really sit right now is on my little mattress pad. The other goal for today is to go grocery shopping because I'm hoping to be able to like cook a little bit more here and we have a cute little kitchenette. This is what my bed's looking like right now, but honestly, at least these sheets are really cute. And I'm happy that my room has good lighting during the day. We're at this furniture consignment store. It's a little bit pricey, but we're hitting this first before we go to the thrift stores. you not this is my dream light it is so cool why is it this much at the thrift store so sad we are at our first thrift store right now looking for furniture but getting kind of sidetracked because they have good clothes too so we'll see we did not have any luck at any of those thrift stores but it's okay we're gonna keep shopping a little more today but i'm trying to trust the long process i don't buy things just because it's in front of me because that is a problem i have
moment has finally come we now have light in the room this little lamp shelf we got from target today i think it's so cute This little lamp for my room helps so much because my room looked just like terrifying when we were only using our phone flashlights. I really like this because I'm trying to buy like as little furniture as I can. I feel like this lamp is really cool because it doubles as a shelf. Right now I just have a bunch of my makeup bags. If you guys saw, I went crazy sewing these little bags and I think they're cute. I want them to be displayed, but I also don't know exactly what I'm going to put on these shelves. I've also never used like Facebook Marketplace before or anything, but I'm trying to figure it out because I want a desk and a chair and for like the cheapest price possible and when we were going to the thrift stores they were still a little bit more expensive than i thought it would be i guess i like never really knew since i never really like looked in the furniture section of thrift stores but here's what i have my eye on right now i thought this chair is really cool and it's kind of funky it kind of reminds me of like a salon chair or something and then this desk is literally like so plain but i just want a very plain desk with enough space for me to like sprawl all my stuff out so we are on a little break because today is a fourth of july so a lot of stuff is closed but hopefully i'll get responses on those and then we'll keep furnishing and shopping for more stuff hi friends it is a new day and we are hitting another thrift store i'm more specifically looking for some kitchenware and this is kind of a small goodwill so let's see what they have back and we got a lot of good things duels from goodwill they were only seven bucks each i think we're just gonna keep them kind of around here so that you can kind of eat on the counter i picked up a book three bucks because i read it ends with us a very long time ago but i'm gonna read this then i got these two plates little set of plates they just look kind of like this was like the find of the day. Very excited for these. This wasn't even on purpose, but we went to like a boutique Goodwill. At first I was kind of worried. They just like wouldn't have any furniture or things that I was looking for for the apartment. But honestly, I feel like the smaller selection made me get a lot more stuff. I got these cups, a set of four. They have different designs though. And it was only six bucks for all four of them. These are the last two. I also got a couple other things from the Dollar Tree and from Michael. From the Dollar Tree, I just got some hangers. Alex thought of this really fun idea where I would close my eyes. He would tell me when to stop and I would pick like random colored yarns. I made this top from that challenge, but we decided to do it again because I only brought a crochet hook here. No yarn because I just literally had no room and I've been missing crocheting a lot. So we need to get some yarn, but guys, I don't know if this is mean, but I think these are like the worst possible colors that I could have gotten. I have no clue what I'm going to make out of this, but I need to start brainstorming. Hi guys, update, it is a new day and we are in Venice picking up a chair from Facebook Marketplace. Here's my new chair. Finally got a mattress. Also got a bunch of other goodies today because we did a little Marshalls trip so I will show you guys those as well first off this is the chair that I got from Facebook marketplace from Amazon I got these little carts that kind of fold out like this one of those organizers that hangs over your door and it can hold like my key I got this really cool set always wanted these soda can glasses and it also came with glass straws this isn't super fun but I got a little kit it came with saucepans because we only have like one one tiny pan that we've been using right now and then this big one from Marshall I'm so excited for this I got a little calendar it has like different fruit for each month then I got this little wicker basket which I absolutely love I'm planning on like filling it with yarn and I want the yarn to be like overflowing out of it got a little spatula also got two tops I've mentioned this one before it's by House of Harlow I absolutely love these tops the quality is amazing I thought this was just so adorable I've been obsessed with tops Tops this shape and a baby doll and it's also very like lacy and the very last thing that I got was some nail polish hello guys so I got one of those little wire hangy thing to hang over my door and hopefully store more stuff so I'm just going to build it right now and I got it in pink 
to add a little color to my room. I also set up a couple of my mini crates. I just put receipts in the bottom one, stack really nicely, and then on top I just have like lotion and lip balm and stuff that I commonly use. Also might use those to hold like pens and stuff once I get my desk. I'm so excited, I just ordered my desk, a little like mirror for my desk. Oh, I got a little storage cart. I've always wanted one of those for my dorm and I don't know why I never got one, but I wanna fill it with like books. It's gonna be my makeshift like nightstand table. I don't remember if I showed you guys my little basket, but it already has my crochet stuff in it and I want to stack these books up even higher. I put a couple things just to test this rack out. I think it's so cute and it adds a little pop of color to my room so I really like how this turned out. I swear nothing is worse than a stuffy room. I've actually never really bought one of these before, but hopefully it does the job. I also got a second pillow because the one pillow on the bed was just not doing it for me. Boyfriend is boyfriending so hard right now. the same vibe as your, your room at home. Ooh, I added some things. I'm eventually going to put this calendar up, probably just right in front of the dad. I'm going to do a little DIY with this picture frame, obviously not leaving this photo in. And then I put all the little crates in here. They're probably going to hold pens and stuff. I don't know what's going to be down there. I mean, my laptop, but it's coming together. It's so cute. Hello friends, it is a new day. You might not be able to tell because I'm kind of wearing the same thing, but we are building this guy right now. I'm going to be using it kind of like my nightstand table. I also got this really cool clock that I also want to put in there, so let's get to building. finished my literal wheelie cart. I would say this was an absolute success. It took like 20 minutes maybe and it was so easy. I'm thinking of pushing it over here right next to my bed. Guys, I just finished decorating this. I want all of this to be filled with like books, but honestly it has a lot of space. I also set up this little clock and I really love how it looks like wood and how like the numbers are so huge. I don't know. I think it's really cute. Um, but yeah, this is the finished thing and I absolutely love it. I cannot believe I'm saying this but I think that is pretty much it for all of the things I'm building for my room so all that's really left is fully decorating it but that won't come until I actually move in for school so I'm gonna clean up the place a little bit and then I will show you guys what my finished room looks like for now hi friends what is up so I am going to show you my finished room for now it's still a little bit bare but it's pretty much all furnished i'm just gonna bring more decorations in once i like officially move in but i am so happy with how it's looking it's so minimal and cute so let's do a really quick tour is the finished room. I think it looks so cute. I'm very happy with it. But thank you guys so much for joining with me on this little journey of moving into my new apartment and beginning to furnish everything. I'm so happy with how it turned out and it's definitely made me more excited to move back here in August once school officially starts. Thank you guys so much again for joining me and I hope you're having a lovely summer. I'll see you guys in my next video.